up you guys after show reacts here and today I'm going to be reacting to the hundred uh, season 2 episode uh, 15 this is the penultimate episode to the season um, I hope you guys are excited because I am I was supposed to record this and the finale yesterday uh, but I was just kind of in a bit of a mood uh, some things are happening at the moment I just yeah, just wasn't really in the mood to record. So, here I am today, in a little bit of a better mood. Those things are still occurring, but, eh, nothing I can do about it right now. Um, but anyways, uh, let's go over the comments. I would say it was called Ton DC and not Washington by the Grounders because they had found a sign or plaque with only the Ton DC left on Washington DC and they'd never heard of Wash. That's probably really smart actually. Okay, yeah. It's like in Fallout in New Vegas, there's a town called Novak. The reason it's called that is it's a makeshift surrounding a motel with a sound with a sign that says no vacancy, except it's missing letters to spell Novak. Oh okay. Um, Jasper's line of don't tell me Finn finally got his peace talks is a great way to remind the audience that everyone inside the mountain has been cut off from everything that has happened outside. And as the audience, we know that, but the line helps drive it home that they have missed a lot. Yeah. Uh, Clark has the precision accuracy to shoot the bullet through Lincoln's shoulder to kill the mountain man. She could have avoided organs, arteries, and bones. If she was that accurate, she could have just shot the guy in the head and saved Lincoln a lot of pain. I mean, yes. Yeah, probably. Uh, I know what you mean. Whenever I watch someone react to this episode, I always say, why don't you just shoot him in the head over and over again? I don't know. I would say probably because, like, the guy's got a knife to his throat and it's like, shoot to like hit a certain artery so it doesn't like he, he physically can't go like that with it but I don't know how that really works to be honest so I don't know <laughs> um alright and the comments for the next episode uh sadly now the toxic ship war has will, will begin what 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 uh, the Klexa ship in the fandom started with their first interaction in episode 7. Oh. Well, I, okay. Uh, the needle stopped at the middle 7 because it's measuring the pH of the tank and 7 on the pH is neutral, like distilled water, for example. Okay. I didn't know that. Okay. Um, you have to remember that this show takes place in 2149, so before the bombs, they were... They were still many years ahead of us. They had more advanced technology. Also, this is a science fiction show, so naturally there's more futuristic stuff in the show. Fair enough. Uh, it's been confirmed by Les Taylor and the showrunner Jason Rothberg, Rothenberg about Clark being bisexual as canon, but it's been since on the ground that she figures out that she's bisexual after the relationships she's had being since being on Earth. Like with Finn and now with the experience with Lexa. Though there are a lot of people, mainly lesbians in the Klexa fandom on Twitter, who like to erase that she's bisexual and just believe that she's gay and lesbian. Um, when, in tr when that's not the truth at all. Well that's... Mm, okay. I mean if it's confirmed by the showrunner specifically... Um, and the actress, that she's bisexual, then she's bisexual. Okay. Nobody can write that off as like, now nah, she's just into girls and that's it. No. You can't... You can't change somebody else's sexuality. It is theirs to decide. Um... Not super futuristic, I mean, in the 100, the world got nuked in the 2040s, and we have those kinds of drones today. Fair enough. I 
just mean, I don't know, I feel like even though we would have the, um, capability, I guess, the knowledge to be able to build futuristic stuff like that, I feel like, I don't know if we would build it that quickly. I don't know. Because it just, look, it, I've brought this up before, but it's kind of like Dr. Stone. Um, the idea, it's an anime and it's really good, by the way. Um, it, the idea is like everyone's like frozen in stone for like a thousand years or something. I think a thousand years. Um, and then a really, really smart guy just breaks out of the stone and everyone's basically in the stone age and he's like, he's like an inventor and he like invents all these things. Well, not really invents, but reinvents the stuff. And even then you're still in the stone age, you know? And I'm not saying that we're in the Stone Age here, but, like, you still have to create all of these extra things to create, I don't know. I don't know how to explain what I'm trying to say. I, 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 I've just given up. <laughs> Nothing we've seen in the first two seasons is outside the possibilities of our current technology in 2022. But that's what I mean. Currently, in 2022, we haven't gone through new, that giant nuclear war or whatever the fuck happened. You still have to start from scratch. A Raven is 19. Wick is somewhere in his 20s. The actor of Wick is 8 years older than Lindsay Raven. The actor Wick being 27 would work and as a 27 year old I wouldn't have dated a 19 year old. My opinion would probably change in an apocalypse. There aren't very many people to choose from. <laughs> I guess. Uh, I'm sure there's a lot of stuff that has been in the first two seasons that isn't possible with t today's technology. For example, I don't think bone marrow can change your d blood DNA forever. Um, well, I think at the very least, it is kind of silly because, like, it's not like, like, this generation of mountain men would be able to go out and live normal lives, sure. Assuming, you know, the grounders don't get them. But, when they have children, they're just going to have the same problem. Because why would the bone marrow be hereditary? So, realistically, they're really stupid. They should be, um... They should be breeding with the people of the Ark. So that the next generation can go out. This... <laughs> That's stupid. <laughs> um, Shan, you don't have to read this comment. This is just me replying to James. Well, I'm going to read it anyways. Uh, the whole blood transfusion, bone marrow transplant idea works with a number of things. It's working to boost someone's immunity and radiation is extremely questionable. Transfusing radiated blood through their own bodies would probably do the opposite of healing them it would more likely cause them even more damage. That said, I'm not in the medical field and there's crazy advance advances uh, in this field all the time. Uh, who knows what would be possible? Also, this bone marrow transfusion has only shown to be temp a temporary solution. We don't know if it will stop working in six months down the road. Exactly. Yeah. Um... Fruits, make no sudden movements. There's a tiny monkey hiding in your shirt pocket. <laughs> I'm gonna name it Wally for uh, reasons. <laughs> uh, I was wondering if anyone would ever notice that. I, I do have another one. Um, another shirt like that with a little thing in the pocket and um yeah I'm not gonna say what it is but if you if you ever work it out you're gonna be like why <laughs> uh, Clark most decidedly promised those people she'd come back for them before she left uh, Clark is one of them people who is not good at keeping her promises well I mean she is trying to come back for them so. I mean, 
Uh, damn it, Fritz. I had to drink real slowly there. You, lady, you are carrying your own head. I mean, I know <laughs> it can get lonely, but this could have gotten messy. I don't even remember saying that. Um, I mean, sure, they were playing dead, but those Mount Weather Guards should have at least had their weapons drawn regardless. Uh, I find it kind of hard to believe Jasper and them were easily able to overtake them. TV show? Got a TV show. Uh, yeah, Eliza didn't sound Aussie there, but you know, what I like to think, what I like to see though, these sky people have lived up in space the longest time, the Ark was probably an international effort to stay alive, I would like to see people with other accents because there's bound to be, to have been people with an American accent on the station, then again, without an American accent on the station, then again, 150 years, prob people probably all started talking the same accent over time, kind of like how the Grandas started talking their own language. Probably. I gotta say, I think it would be very jarring hearing like a like a British person that was living on the Ark. I don't know. Um, I mean, I feel like uh, whinging Lincoln. In that part of his shoulder, the bullet would have hit a major artery. But yeah, sure, let's go with good shot. <laughs> Gross, how dare you connect the 100 with the, the Charmed Reboot. I very much doubt Abifail was uh, named after Abby and Kane. Quick Google search leads to no connections. You never know. Um, well, what's... Well, that's what you get for making jokes, my dude. Let that be a lesson. Make bad jokes and you end up super dead. Facts of life. Uh, I mean, it was probably a mine, but we made bad jerks all the time, and for some reason, we're both super alive. Well, as alive as we can be, right? Do you think I am alive? Holy shit, that is Chad Charming, and he's just appeared on screen, and I hate <laughs> him already. Bitch hasn't even said anything. Can we use him as a test dummy to clear the path through those mines added later? I am disappointed. He is still alive by the end of the episode. He didn't even say anything. <laughs> uh, why are they zigzagging to get out of the minefield? I'd be trying to head for the closest hill. It looks like they're heading for the hill that's furthest away. I don't know, man. Aside from it being a fake green screen, the meteor didn't go all that way because it that'd be bad too much pressure and the machine would have exploded i find it kind of odd that the meter started in on the red while it was dormant though you'd think the red would be reserved as the color of warning too much pressure maybe yeah. um borderline futuristic i suppose I don't think we in today's society are using drones like that to defend borders just yet. Uh, I think it might be a dumbass idea anyways. Uh, drones can easily be shot out of the sky. I'm looking forward to delivery drones. That's gonna be chaos. Yeah! Um, maybe they'll finally be able to deliver to my house without saying sorry. You're not home. Bitch, I'm home! Anyways. We have an episode to get into. Meryl it's something kind of weird about the fact that she's just made you. out with the Not girl that caused with to... Come with me. You're safe now. And 44 don't people don't just vanish inside Love of a sealed bunker. They could if they had enough help. He's back for you! Get up. It's time to go. I told you I'd come back for you. Come on out. People are marching on Mount Weather right now. Too much noise. Shush, guys! Shush! Time you just get break up! Time you shove up! Shove up! <laughs> it's so weird. It does sound like this. Like, 
English. Someone on the outside going for the main door. When they get it open, all hell will break loose. That is the signal for my friends to come here, and then... My fellow citizens, this is your president speaking. I have news to share with you that will change all of our lives forever. For 97 years... Mount Weather has been our home. It kept us alive, but it is... Oh, I thought they let him go. Most of us have made peace with what we've had to do to survive. We've done these things for one reason, so that our people could someday return to the ground. That day is today. He's going public. Before my friend, Laura Lysi, was murdered by the outsiders still at large in this mountain, she found a cure. It was in their bone marrow. Here, I'll be back. Where are you going? He's trying to get his people to turn on each other. They'll find my friends. I have to bring them here now. I'll send them in groups. You get your people ready to go, but you wait for me to come back. Do you understand? Wait. Thank you. You free your people. Protect mine when they get here. We can thank each other when we're all outside. This has been the dream of our people since the bombs. But to reach it now, I need your help. The 44 criminals that are radiated level 5, killing 15 of our people, are now keeping us from that dream. Although we've repaired our home, we can never replace the lives that were so viciously taken from us. Whose yes, fault is that? It is to believe there are those among us who would help the people who did this. And I am speaking to you now. If you truly want to end the blood treatments once and for all, then the 44 murderers you're now hiding are the key to doing that. You have one hour to turn them in without punishment. After that, we'll be forced to consider you enemies of the state. I'm asking you, please. Do what's right for your people. Our people. So that we can all take our rightful place on the ground. We're almost home. What are they doing? Preparing to attack. They're too close for missiles, sir. Without the veil, there is nothing we can do from the inside. All ground units are ready to engage on your command. Not yet. Sir, the longer we wait... They came looking for a fight, Emerson. Doesn't mean we need to give them one. As long as we're behind the doors, they can't touch us. Unless someone opens the door. What about the intruder? He is still at large, sir. We're doing everything we can. 45! Go door to really? door. Really? You're gonna throw paper? Find them. Really? If I had paper, I'd throw it just... Just to tell you how stupid that is. Yes? Step aside, please. According to your neighbors, you've been bringing extra food home after meals. That's not true. Is it true that you've refused treatment 12 times in the past 15 years? Or that you've refused I mean, them 30 times? I mean, they haven't times? needed them. Do you deny that? To... Because they haven't we gone out, We take the blood right? when we need it. We don't take extra food. Then you've got nothing to worry about. There's a ring of, it could just be, One, you put your drink down there before. Two, three. Please, don't do that. Four, five. Wait, wait, wait. Please don't shoot. Oh. We're here, okay? Just leave them alone. I'm so sorry. This healing, we just sorry. found two more. We're bringing them in now. Well, that was rude. They were loyal to the end. Welcome, Sky Crew. Join us. I'm really confused. I thought we were ah, charging into battle. Package from Raven. I just <laughs> she said he would do the job. Good. Field commanders. Today's the day we get our people back. The enemy thinks it's safe behind its doors, but it's not. The mountain men believe the door can't be opened from the outside, so they leave it unguarded. Only it can be. And thanks to our source on the inside, now we know how. According to Maya, the electromagnetic locking system has one flaw. When the power goes out, it disengages. And that's where Raven's team Well, comes that's in. a bit stupid. The mountain's electricity is generated at Philpot Dam. Power outages happen all the time. By now, they've taken the turbine room. It's their job to blow the power. Once they do, we blow the lock. The mountain has cast a shadow over these woods for too long. You've hunted us, controlled us, turned us into monsters. That ends today. Thanks to our alliance with the Sky People, the mountain will fall. As Clark said, we spare the innocent. As for the guilty, 
Juice drain. Juice down. 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 Out of the way, Vincent. That's my daughter. Dad, don't. Quiet. She's been aiding and abetting the outsiders. You need to get out of our way. I won't let you take her, Paul. We've got orders. She knows where they're hiding. Now step aside. I'm not gonna ask you again. If you want her, you gotta go through me. Dad, please, they'll kill you. Don't make me do this, Vincent. <laughs> Sorry, Paul. <laughs> Bellamy? Miller, you okay? Better than you. We need to get everyone in the harvest chamber. You'll be safer there. Safe in the harvest chamber? Just trust me. Are the others there? Not yet. Monty? Monty's with the other group on level three. Don't worry, we moved him after the last sweep. You should go there next. All right, go on. Vincent will take you. I won't be long. Hey, I'm coming with you. Jasper, I promise I'll protect him. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Let's go. Maya. I'll be okay. Your mother would be so proud. I'll see you soon. Be careful. Let's go. Four on two, please report. Over. Where did that come from? Whose is it? We have to do this fast. Welcome to the ground. Give me the last bomb. What happens if we only blow four of the five? Power stays on, door stays locked. Everyone we care about dies. Uh oh. You should have made more than you needed. We both know you aren't here to bring me dinner. It's bad. They're going after our power. I sent a team out to the dam, but there is an army outside of our main door, and they're drilling into it. They must know that there's a delay. I underestimated the commander. Is that what you need me to it say? It wasn't the commander. It was Clark. Dad. You've killed us. One week in office, and you've managed to turn neighbor against neighbor. You've made the outsiders hate us more than they already did. You lost our outer defenses, and now a door that hasn't been breached in 97 years is going to fall. And an army of savages is going to flood these halls, killing every last one of us. Tell me how to stop. You're in charge. Figure it out yourself. Please. I need your help. Your people need your help. He said that in such a manipulative way. He had like a bit of a smile on his face. Like he knew he had to say that to, to get what he wanted. They'll destroy everything. You already have. Wait. Wick, stop. I'm not doing anything. Exactly. Hey, I'm not the one that didn't make enough bombs. Five turbines, five bombs. Maybe even drop the last oh, one. Any engineer I mean, you, oh, any engineer to blame always... for failure. Two is yeah. one, one is none. It's called redundancy. redundancy. That Redundancy, that, that's, that's it. Oh, what, what is? What are you doing? They built more turbines than they needed. When we blow the other four, this one will take the load. Surge protectors will ramp it down to keep it to running. To keep it from blowing up. Yeah, we need to shut down this turbine, Wick. Catastrophic failure, that's your plan? Okay, when you say it like that, it doesn't sound like such a good idea. I'll set the detonators. Let's go 
coming from the dam. They know we're going for the power. They know we're going for the door. Rogo Takeda! They all good! Raven will get it done. She's one of us. As soon as those lights go off, you push that button. We'll do the rest. Today, Wick! I'm moving as fast as I can! Actually, I can go faster. <laughs> Close. Just keep backing up. It's not too close. Not as close as they are. Okay, Emerson. They got the power. Start the clock. She did it. One minute, starting now. Those who lost. Find. Uh oh. What's wrong? Why isn't it working? Damn it! They're jamming us. I have to get closer. Swap on trigger. Shut up. This is why guns are better. If I can get there, I can trigger it manually. No, you can't get there. For me, I have to try. Let go. No. Go, 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 have multiple things being shot at. Someone else should go as well. Somehow, I don't know. Oh. We'll find another way in. There is no other way in. You know that. We don't need one. Ten seconds. Five seconds. That guy just died for no reason. Three, two. Oh, it worked. We need to get to that ridge and take out the shooters. No! You stay with Clark. That means that guy the looks dead. You get that door open. Gun out. Anything happen to you, will we? Jasper, in 30 minutes, all backup power gets diverted for species continuity. That means level five for life support and security. Radiation will seep in everywhere else. I can't go to level five without being shot in the head. Guys, we need to keep moving. Maybe you should have gone with the others like you were supposed to. Extra oxygen, enough to last until your engineers get the power back on. I don't know why. I think Cage Wallace is gonna let me live here after that. You're just slowing us down right now. Like it did. Clark, look. Make sure he's okay. Okay, he's not dead. They'll be waiting just inside the door. Master Eruption! Three to us! No! They are all good, Nepokli! Train your fire on the door! You guys would have won. What is this? Your commanders made a deal. What about prisoners from the Ark? They'll all be killed. But you don't care about that, do you? I do care, Clark. You were going to win. But I made this choice with my head and not my heart. The duty to protect my people comes first. You would have protected them. This. I'm sorry, Clark. Take us around as loud. 
What about blood must have blood? What about that shit? You two. All our people withdraw. Those with the terms. Don't be slaughtered. Let me help them. Sis him up. Yeah, she's gonna have to make a choice here. They're still in there. And our commander's out there under attack for all we know. I don't trust her. Not after Tom DC. Neither should you. I gave you a direct order. Please. This was the plan. Her brother's still in there. If we're not here with the tone generators when they come out, Reaper's plans kill. change. Octavia, let's go. I'm not going anywhere without my brother. I no longer my second. Well, that lasted about five minutes. Octavia, please. Come home with us. You're retreating? I have no home. You'll need this. Really? Come on. Seriously? You're retreating now too? What the? What the hell? They won't do that again, though. Like, Dad, you were right. You took the deal. You're a hero to your people. We've won. No, we haven't. Not yet. Peace with the savages isn't enough to make the ground safe for us. I know. Look, they'll never stop. No parent ever would. You're right. 20 minutes ago, we picked up a small group on radar. I already have a team on the way. Looks like we're gonna have more bone marrow. We'll be on level five until the turbines are fixed. Come down when you're ready. Clark, let's go. We'll come back with reinforcements. Clark. No, it's now or never. It's over. I'm sorry. It can't be over. Hmm. Alrighty, here. Well, that was the hundred season two episode of what was it? Fifteen? Yeah. Um, I cannot believe Lexi did that. Fuck you, man. Dude, that's not cool. Like. Not cool at all. Who's to say they won't come after you? What happened to blood must have blood? After all, they did to your people and you're just like, yeah, I guess. I guess we'll strike a deal. You guys would have won. Don't you get that? I don't know. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Oh, oh, oh.